All right. So, there you go. Oh, it's not surprise. AI. All right. Um, hello, everyone. My name is Bulut. I am the uh, Chief Growth Officer for Alex Finds. And I'll introduce you to our uh, startup, which is an uh, on demand uh, travel concierge service that's powered by uh, artificial intelligence and uh, a human component, too. So uh, I'm pretty sure since this is a travel specific audience, I want to skip all the numbers and just uh, focus on what makes uh, our platform unique. And uh, to do that, I want to first explain the current landscape. So when you look into the uh, applications and uh, services, uh, you basically see two segments. One uh, group of apps like uh, Expedia and Priceline that people use to book hotels and flights. And another group that people use to uh, find places to visit and uh, find things to do. Uh, and even though these applications do certain tasks really well, uh, I think they fail, fail to live up to the uh, potential of uh, providing all the essential needs of uh, modern day travelers. And with Alex Finds, uh, we are here to change that. So our uh, core team uh, uh, consists of uh, PhD uh, computer scientists, uh, growth uh, um, engineers, as well as uh, serial entrepreneurs uh, with uh, 20 years of experience in the travel fields. And our strategy, uh, strategy is uh, basically simple. We want to focus on two essential uh, components to deliver this um, experience with a, a seamless uh, one-stop uh, uh, platform. And the first component that makes up our platform is an AI-powered uh, meta search engine that basically uh, searches uh, 50,000 hotels uh, around the world real time and automatically identifies the best deals uh, based on pricing trends and uh, reviews on demand. And uh, currently, users can access our system uh, via SMS, Twitter, email, and we just integrated with Facebook Messenger and uh, Slack as well. And uh, these uh, uh, user queries are processed by uh, our natural language processing AI and also uh, delivered by the deals are delivered by the same system as well, uh, as well as uh, this system is assisted by human operators too. And the second comp, oh, sorry. And the second component that makes our platform uh, even more unique is the, uh, the, co uh, the community aspect. In order to provide local guidance and uh, concierge, uh, we basically tap into the uh, local experts. And in order to do this, we build a, a community of uh, 3,000 uh, early adopters uh, with a 90% sign up rate. Uh, a really important number. Uh, and not only that these people are really influential and uh, knowledgeable in their own fields, but they also uh, command the attention of uh, 172 million people uh, with their email list and uh, social accounts. And um, we will be working with them to uh, connecting, uh, matching them with uh, the travelers uh, through our platform. Um, and where we are right now is uh, we basically uh, uh, accepted to um, start up Chile. And uh, I'll be expecting questions, sorry. So there's a lot of players in this space. If mm -hmm. you were to tell me the single best advantage you have over all of them, what would it be? I would say our technology, first and foremost, because we developed our own uh, AI system and uh, we can deliver uh, the best uh, deals to our uh, audience much quickly and without uh, needing them to do the search, we do the search on their behalf. So I would say our technology. Are you making money yet? or? We are. Uh, we basically launched the beta version of our platform uh, in March. And since then, we generated a few hundred uh, service requests and fulfilled them successfully. And currently, we are working on uh, integrating the community aspects uh, to the main platform. Sure. So you've got two models. Mm -hmm. One is a meta search. One is a local experts. Mm -hmm. Local experts have never worked. We've seen, we've seen this model before. No one's been successful. Mm -hmm. Why are you going to be successful when they're not successful? Um, so I would like to explain that strategy in private, but uh, as a general uh, idea, uh, we basically rely on our uh, local ex experts currently uh, almost as a business generation tool, and our main business model is actually going to be operated from the uh, AI engine. So, so, it's not the when you say best, you mean best value, whatever mm -hmm. I perceive as the best value. Mm -hmm. So, how are you determining my perception of best value when you're saying you're doing a meta search to bring something forward? Um, or is it strictly lowest price? So that's a good question. So uh, I think that depends on the input that we generate from the users. If it's uh, only a simple search query, I can uh, just uh, basically the, the way our system works is it compares your price points 
and then uh, the location that you selected, and then we uh, bring the uh, base value uh, uh, strictly on the monetary value. But if you are to provide more, uh, I think, factors to the system, then a human operator steps in, and then I think we can work with you to uh, provide the value in your uh, conception. Okay. So. Any other questions? How do you compensate these local experts? Uh, currently, we are working on that business model. Uh, right now, uh, our plan is to uh, charge users uh, by minutes and then do revenue sharing with the audience. But since we are, uh, we basically uh, haven't launched the uh, local expert uh, component yet, so that business model is certainly uh, not hundred percent certain. But uh, our current idea is to do uh, minutes uh, charging users by minute and doing revenue sharing. And, and how do you find the users? So that's actually um, uh, the main reason we uh, started with the uh, local expert section. Uh, right now, we haven't spent a single dollar on our marketing. We do cross promotion with our local expert. As I said, um, uh, our uh, currently the content platform on our website is basically our cross promotion tool as well. And as we are working with our uh, local experts, uh, we do cross promotions, and through their own uh, promotions, we uh, <laughs> uh, gain attraction and uh, market awareness. Any other questions? When are you going live? Uh, our beta version is live as of uh, March. Uh, for the um, the actual final version, that's like when I actually cut off. Uh, our actual t uh, technical team will uh, move to Chile for the next four or five months to participate in a startup Chile, and we hope to go uh, online uh, with full capability um, uh, in the last quarter of uh, 2016. Thank you. Thank you very much.